Hey guys, it's Taylor here from Tauranga Cars and I'm bringing you a very cool vehicle today. It's a 2004 Chevy Trailblazer LTZ, which is the top spec trim edition. This vehicle here comes with a 5.3 litre Chevy Vortec engine, a really reliable engine, especially um, given the Ks that this vehicle's only done um, 87,000 Ks, so it's a, in very good nick actually. It's a beast of a vehicle, absolute beast, and for the year of the vehicle, it's got so many nice features in it. It's got a um, full four-wheel drive with auto, four-wheel drive, four high, four low, and two-wheel drive. It's got a Bluetooth head unit with reverse camera. It's got dual zone climate controls as well as rear climate control. It's got um, features that are really awesome to have such as memory position seats, heated seats, automatic windows, lumbar adjust, full leather interior trim which is really nice. It's got cruise control, it's got an English dash cluster so even though this is a Japanese import this vehicle here has information on the dash cluster in English. You can change the settings which is really good to be able to do. Um, overall it's a exceptionally cool car to drive. It's left hand drive but it's actually really easy to get used to. Got full tints all through the back. This vehicle here seats seven as well so it's got lots of space for your rear occupants. And then to drop these seats you just lift this lever and then you lift this lever and they fold right up out of the way and then you get access to this rear row here and you can even do this. So you lower this one down and then pull on this and these all go completely flat as well allowing you to have some pretty epic boot space in the vehicle. If we drop this down again, we end up with a nice tray that we can load things onto. It's um, impressive in size, as I said, it's an American vehicle, so what else would you expect? If we put that back up there, bring this one forward again, get this one out of the way, drop this down, back up. There we go. Coming around to the rear of the vehicle. Tow hitch there, you just need to put your, whatever you want to put to tow with in there. Bloody excellent tow vehicle. It's got split tailgates, so you can open up the rear window. Plenty of space even with those seats up. If we drop this down, we can also open up the full tailgate. And as you can see, heaps of room in there. Lots of room for your rear occupants, legs, middle row have good room as well. All the way up to the front, air vents in the roof. This vehicle's really, really grunty as well, being a 5.3 litre V8. Yet I believe they developed this engine with the ability to shut off cylinders on highway running. So it can go to a four cylinder and use less fuel. It's very economical, I drove it down from Auckland and we got through just under a quarter of a tank of fuel to get back from Auckland. It wasn't too much to, um, too much fuel consumption. Around town it's a little bit more thirsty, but a lot of people will be using these sorts of vehicles for towing and uh, perhaps four wheel driving, or just because they're an enthusiast. We've fitted brand new Hankook Dynapro AT2 Extreme tires on this one, as it had snow tires. It's had new brake rotors on the front as well. It's a really cool car and um, runs really nicely it's very quiet it's surprisingly quiet when you plant your foot it does get noisy like any v8 american engine does but we like that under the bonnet tidy in here plenty of service stickers so it's clearly been quite well maintained in its time in japan it's just had a full service done with us as well. On the roof we have roof rails with adjustable roof racks on it. These can slide along, it's a nice feature to have. We've also got a sunroof on this vehicle. Takes premium unleaded, big tank in it. But you're buying an American vehicle, you know what you're in for. Very cool car, and we may do another video of us driving it. A bit hard on my own, but just love this thing, eh? You can see why people like American vehicles. 
there's a certain presence about them. You hop in here on this side of the vehicle, surveying the landscape from inside your beast and uh, it does make you feel pretty cool. The sunroof opens completely up and it also pops up if you want to just have it cracked a little bit. Awesome, and it's also got Bluetooth audio and a factory Bose speaker system, I believe, according to what I've read. So that's quite cool. You can adjust the rear vents from here. Great air conditioning, blows extremely cold. Lots of storage compartments, sunglasses. Um, yeah, really, really cool car. And the interior is in a pretty good condition, I'd say. Really, really good condition. So everything works on it as well, which is a nice thing to have. Um, Pop on down, 10, 15th Ave and check it out.